Yeah, I think it's, a, it's an important week coming up here for, for the Cobras. I think as the competition went on, we, we always look to, to see where we can improve 5%. So it's very important that we, we really stay focused and stay in our bubble. Obviously, we, we're playing good cricket, so the mood is obviously up there. Um, I think this next game is a very vital game for us, almost like a final. And the guys are just looking, looking forward to it. Um, today, out in the nets, they'll work on their specific game plans and, and stuff to execute. And like I said, we, we're looking forward to the game and hopefully get a win. Yeah, the key games against the Warriors and Dolphins. Um, and all three of us are sitting really nice and tight on top. Um, so it's, it's all about who handles the pressure um, really well. Um, and I think it's, it's important that we as a squad really stay calm. Um, and back our game plans and, and really just look to execute our skills. Obviously the Warriors are playing good cricket, they um, one of the teams to look out for and obviously the Dolphins are also up, up there. The Titans you can't throw away because they're also a very good side and got very good players in there. So I think it's it's very much open um, between that between those four teams. Um, we just got to look at our own game and obviously just play good cricket and control the stuff we can control. Yeah, it's been really good. Um, I think we've we've had some close games throughout this competition and luckily for us we've ended at the right side of it, which is great for team morale and team confidence. So it's for us it's it's, it's a key moment for us to, to really just nail our, our and execute our skills. Yeah, we're in a great mood. Um, I think the Cobra boys are, are rearing to go. Um, everyone's been working nicely together and, and always really solution focused. I think, um, well, 50 overs is a long time. I just keep telling me it's a long time. So I give me a fair enough chance to get it in. And then um, obviously for me, that's works for me over the years, is just focus on playing straight in the V and then obviously the full and all the, all the short ball you capitalize on. For me, I'm, I'm a very basic guy, so I, I try to keep it as simple as possible because cricket is, is a hard game. Um, I don't, I don't want to make it too difficult for myself. And uh, like I said, just, I'm just concentrating playing, playing in the V, playing straight as possible and then obviously getting myself in and then at the, at the, at the end practicing the long hits as well. I think at the start of the competition we, we struggled a bit with our, our form up top um, and we addressed it nicely and, and, and at the moment in a key period of the competition they managed to, to strike form and those partnerships with uh, up front are key in, in building a, a big innings, especially with two new balls it's always a tricky affair to, to manage um, and our batsmen at the moment are, are managing to, to really just strike up those partnerships to, to build good platforms. Yeah, I think it's important for, for, the, for the Cape Town and Western Cape fan base um, to have cricket and, and for us to, to be able to be in a position to be able to achieve it is very important. Um, Western Cape cricket is a proud uh, province about their cricket and, and the fans are one of the most loyal in the country. So hopefully we can, we can at the end of this week um, secure one for, for, for Cape Town.